Smartphones going up in flames. That's what we've seen from users of Samsung's new flagship phone, the Galaxy Note 7, which retails for about $900 to $1,000. Over the past few weeks, we've seen users uploading pictures and video to social media of these phones seemingly exploding and burning while they were charging. Samsung says they know of 35 cases of this, and now they're taking the unprecedented step of recalling nearly 2.5 million of these units. The company says it's specifically a problem with the battery. They say the batteries come from two different suppliers, and only one of them has the problem, but they're not saying which of the suppliers it is. The recall's happening in 10 different countries, including South Korea and the United States, in about two weeks. But Samsung says if you already have one of these products and you're concerned, you can take it to the store and switch it out for a different model now. Samsung waited until late Friday night South Korea time until after their shares had already stopped trading to announce this. Now investors have all weekend to mull this over. There's never a good time for something like this, but it's taking place right when Samsung was clawing its way back from a major rut. And they're having success because of this family of phones. Some people have called the Note 7 the best big phone on the entire market. On top of that, this is all happening during IFA here in Berlin, Germany. It's one of the biggest tech shows in the world, and Samsung wanted all the attention on their new product announcements. Instead, everybody's talking about this problem. To make matters worse for Samsung, next week is Apple's big event. CNN Money will be there, and we're expecting the new iPhone 7. So Samsung was trying to get as much publicity as possible before that, but not this type of PR.